Hello everyone and welcome to Custom Android. Today we are going to review RD MUI 2.9.28 and uh, it's running on, uh, it's based on Sense 4.1 Android 4.0 and it's a sort of version of HTC 2.17.41.2 and uh, this is uh, best rated MUI for HTC One X based on Sense interface on uh, XDA developers forum it uh, it have uh, over 30 votes and the uh, score is 5.00 so the best rated MUI ROM for HTC One X well, let's go and take a look uh, this is a uh, lock screen the background is not default, I have changed it. And uh, here is a lock screen. You have four options. You can go to dialer left, or you can go to text messages right, or to camera mode up down is for unlocking. And this is a default home screen and the default MUI launcher. So I must admit, uh, over all these years, uh, this is this is my first MIUI ROM. Okay, so this is my my first impression on this. I'm very satisfied, and I I like how how it's made it, and uh, generally. This this this, this MIUI is is a, a very good coded, so I I have tried a lot of things. On, on it and uh, the, there was neither one force, clo uh, for, force close error or, or any kind of bag bugs so it's perfectly running and later I will show you benchmark scores it's it's uh, almost exactly as, as any other I have tested so if you're looking and if you're a fan of MUI MUI ROM, custom ROM and you have HTC One X this is a perfect ROM Run for you, and uh, for all all of those for all of you who 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 didn't tried MUI, I must say that uh, uh, generally MUI custom ROMs on uh, on any other device uh, have have a very huge base of fans all over the world. So that's it. Let's take a look, and uh, like you can see, uh, MUI is is built to to look something like iOS and iPhone. So, uh, like you can see, the icons and the home screen, and the uh, absent of app drawer. So you don't have uh, app drawer. You don't have icon for it. That's it. Every application you download, it's here you know, on home screen. So that's it. And uh, the advantage of MUI ROM is a, a huge, huge base of themes you can download it. Okay, I will show you. Here it is. Okay, uh, this is a themes you can download. And I don't know how huge this list is because I, I I didn't manage to reach the end of it. So many many possibility for team customization. And okay, uh, right now one theme is downloading. It's a iPhone theme, and. Uh, I don't know why why it's so slow. Maybe it's a huge team or maybe just the connection is not so good. But I, I have downloaded one theme and this was this one was quick. So okay, you have uh themes uh this those themes are for everything. You you, you choose okay, let's see. We choose this one, for example, and here is the screenshots of it so you can take a look and see 
does it fit you? If you like it, you just click download and when you choose it, you have here on local. And uh, here is a mix. You can you can customize uh, any of these things like lock screen, icon, wallpaper, notification, status bar, home, boot animation. You just click here and go online and choose one. That's it. I will be back later in the show you how how team changing is working so that's it uh, you also have uh, two music applications you have the default one which comes with sense a regular music player also you have a MUI music player here it is and Okay, let's let's play this track and show you some things. When you play it, it's here showing on notification bar, on not on notifications. So when you go on lock screen, here here's a widget on lock screen by default. Uh, that's it. Then. You have controls of your music player on lock screen. It's very nice looking. You can pause his here now remove it. And uh, also there is a two galleries coming by default. Uh, this one is is MUI gallery. I didn't try it, so I don't I didn't create account. And here is the default gallery, default sense gallery. Also, you have tools in folders, in folder right here. This is the settings. Generally, this this default theme is is a very, very nice, very good looking. You'll have some settings added here. So, okay, that's it. Let's go to dialer. Here is contact list. That was email notification. Generally, that's that's it. Here is a SMS. Okay, now let's let's go and uh, and take a look. Okay, I forgot this thing. You can you can add. edit widgets so you can add more home screens here down there are widgets you can add and also you can edit current one like this press on clock to edit you have also themes for the clock Okay, now let's let's try and change whole team. I will choose. Let's go and choose this one that I have previously down downloaded. Okay, just press apply and see what we will get. Okay, that's it. And voila. whole team is changed
so that's that's it for this review thank you for watching it I hope you like it and uh, see you next time all the best